Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to our first English class with Miss Mila, who is me. And I'm not even English, I am Italian. So many of you guys have been asking me for a recording, a video in English and so, so, so many times I've been dealing with what kind of video guys would you like? I don't know, just a vlog with me, vlogging in English, would you like me having a conversation with someone who does speak English, would you just like grammar English lessons or I don't know, I don't actually know. Let's just start. So that's what we are gonna do. I'm gonna do this first video, let's see if you guys like the format, let's see if you guys understand me and we will figure out what to do. So first of all, I would like you guys to let me know if I'm talking too fast, if you would like me to talk slowly, if you would like subtitles for the videos, for not for this one, I mean for the next videos, and just let me know about subtitles. Would you like subtitles in English? So I'm speaking English with English subtitles, or would you like Italian subtitles. Just would like you guys to enjoy this video. I don't feel like wow I loved it, but what the fuck did she say? <laughs> I don't I don't want that. What we're gonna do today is just try to figure out three mistakes that Italians do when they speak in English and also three mistakes that you guys English speakers do when you speak Italian. Even if you guys do not speak Italian, you're not studying Italian, I am pretty sure wherever you're from, England, Scotland, American, whatever in the world, guys, you've been to an Italian restaurant. So, first Italian mistake is the word succo di frutta, which in English is juice. Italian people usually say juice. I don't know why Italians figure it out, the word juice has to be said Jewish. So no thank you. The word is juice. Like apple juice, orange juice, all my days. Sorted! I had a list of the three mistakes Italians do when they speak in English and I just sorted it with apple juice, orange juice. Three words that Italians say wrong. Juice, which is succo di frutta. Apple, which is mela. Please guys stop saying apple because it's not apple, it's apple, like apple juice. And the third word is orange. So, so many times I've been with Italians say orange. It's orange, orange juice. The color is orange, the fruit itself is orange. So here we are, three mistakes Italians do in English are apple, juice, orange. Sort it. I, I didn't know it was so easy. Now let's go to the mistake that people who speak English do when they speak Italian. Spaghetti. Please guys, wherever you're from, whatever menu you're reading, do not say spaghetti, do not say spaghetti, do whatever. <laughs> spaghetti. This is a common mistake, like so many times. I've been having dinner with my English friends or Scottish friends, British friends, people that speak English, right? And they were like spaghetti or spaghetti. <laughs> no, that word is Italian and is spaghetti. Second mistake is the word bruschetta. I am sick of <laughs> you guys saying bruschetta or bruschetta or bruschetta. It's bruschetta. It's a slice of bread with some tomatoes and olive oil, but it's bruschetta. Please say it right. Third and uh, last word is mozzarella. I truly understand, guys. It may be hard for you to say mozzarella, but mozzarella, mozzarella, mozzarella is not correct. The word is mozzarella. Please try and say that with me. Mozzarella, bruschetta, spaghetti. 
I don't think it's art, but obviously just because I'm Italian. In the same way, I don't think it's art saying juice, apple, orange, but I know that even after watching this video, too many Italians will still say orange, juice, no sorry, juice, juice and apple. So let's try it together one more time. Apple, juice, orange, spaghetti, bruschetta, mozzarella. I really hope you guys enjoy this video and thanks for watching. Oh yes, people who speak English always say thank you and please. But we're gonna talk about that in another video. I hope guys you enjoy this video. Please let me know in a comment down here if if you like this kind of video, if you like more video in English, if you... Se vi è piaciuto ragazzi, fatemi sapere se questo tipo di video vi può interessare, se va bene come questa volta che tipo correggiamo quelli che sono gli errori che noi italiani facciamo alle volte per colpa dell'insegnante sbagliato, del film visto in maniera sbagliata o se invece vi interessa altra tipologia di video, non lo so. Please let me know with a comment, thanks for watching and see you!